ChatGPT is known for its impressive capabilities, but perplexity and application based on ChatGPT takes it a step further. Unlike ChatGPT, which can't source information from specific places, perplexity allows users to define their sources. And this feature is particularly useful for those in the medical field who need authoritative and current data. Perplexity is available as a web or mobile app, so you can download it for your iPhone or your Android phones, and it leverages ChatGPT's analysis abilities, but also conducts real-time internet searches to provide up-to-date responses. So you'll start by visiting perplexity.ai, where you can specify your preferred sources under the focus tab. Choosing academic for research purposes would be ideal. So let's say um, you are looking into managing recurrent genital herpes. So what you need to do is you first go here and choose academic and then you simply input this query into perplexity so you will just write management of recurrent genital herpes and then uh, perplexity shifts through various resources like NIH because it has to be publicly available in publicly accessible outlets um, then only it can scrap the information from those sources and uh, then only it can compile the relevant information. So now what it does is it provides citations uh, to the sources from where it takes the information. So if we go here, you can see that now it is scrapping the internet to find the relevant information and it has mostly used NIH, the PubMed journal articles, and it has scrapped the information and it gives you succinct information based on the academic resources. So instead of wading through journals yourself or doing broad internet searches, you can let Perplexity do all that work while delivering answers in a user-friendly format, perfect for study preparation. So I hope this tool proves useful for your preparation. And as someone who is enthusiastic about integrating modern technology into learning and healthcare, I'm open to discussing similar tech applications or answering any questions about utilizing these technologies effectively. Just drop them in the comments below. Thanks and take care. All the best.